What's up everybody? I'm Dustin and this is Tech Lifeline and today I'm going to show you that a low tier graphics card can not only do good, run in crossfire, but you can also run triple screens. So check it out. Alright so excuse the mess here, but here's my triple screens, two of them our HP thrift store screen, so I got it for super cheap. This one I got off uh, eBay, it's Asus. But as you can see there, I have three screens set up, mainly for workflow. I don't really try with games, but I did try the Crimson software which stretches your game across the whole screen, and it did nothing but mess up on me. But we're gonna try it again today. Last time I had to delete everything, like uninstall all my drivers and the Crimson software. But I'm gonna try it again. We're gonna see if it works. If it does, it does. If it don't, I got a lot of work to do. Anyways, I'm gonna show you how all this works. How I got three screens on an RX 460. Start off with, I know my cabling's messed up. I gotta, this is kinda temporary until I redo everything. I had, uh, this display port to VGA and then you get in here right here is my DVI and right here is my HDMI I have it all running off one graphics card not both of them so now all we got left to do is try that crimson software and see if it works all right as you can see all three screens are working I can uh, stretch it across all the screens with the background but that's how I have it set at this moment but we're gonna try some games and see if that works but first we're gonna have to go into the crimson software okay so what we're gonna do is go over here to iFanity and we're gonna go to quick setup My screens are doing some funny stuff. Not doing anything. There's one screen, two screen, three screen. And it's not looking very good. It looks like we're going to have to go to the advanced. and still thinking. Oh, see? It's like stretching across all the screens now. But it doesn't look very good and there you have it three screens with AMD software it definitely needs some fine tuning as you can see over here but it does work and with a few settings you could definitely get it right but as you can see there you go RX 460 triple screens there's a little problem right there, but we'll fix it. This has been Tech Life Find with this short little video just to show you it is possible. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you later. Okay, so if you have any problems setting it up and it just won't align right, the best thing you can do is go on back into iFinity and press discard. There's a little trash can, you press discard, and then your, your screens will go back to normal, I promise you. Uh, the first time I did it, I uninstalled the entire program and reinstalled it. So, yes, I'm still having a little trouble with it, but it is possible. But this is on an RX 460 with triple monitors and crossfire, and it works, that's the point of this video.